It's Friday once again, which means it's time for our weekly update, which today includes some exciting news about the Blackmagic flagship camera, a new update loaded with new features for the Aperture Status Link Pro, and a new Alexa 35 update from Adi. Blackmagic announced their top-of-the-range Ursusina 12K camera is now available to buy as a body-only option. This offers significant savings for those looking to build their own rig in their own way. The savings come in the form of multiple accessories being excluded, such as the top handle, base plate, shoulder mount, lens mounts, the 8TB SSD module and more. It's worth noting that the body-only version includes all the recording modes and features as the kit version, so it's not limited in any way. The main difference here between the kit and the body-only version are that the body comes with a CF Express Media module without any media cards, as well as an EF mount as standard. These can be swapped accordingly, of course, with the purchase of optional accessories. Aperture released a new update for their Citus Link Pro app. Firmware update version 1.3 comes packed with new features, such as undo and redo buttons, expanded DMX parameters, on and off switches, as well as enhanced CCT and RGB control for enhanced precision. Citus Link Pro is a professional wireless lighting control app offering extensive control for any DMX control fixtures, such as intensity, color temperature, hue and saturation, all packed into an intuitive and easy to navigate user interface. Last week we had a new Alexa 35 camera and this week Adi released a new firmware update for existing Alexa 35 cameras called SUP 4.0.0. They're skipping the number three and going straight to number four with the last SUP being 2.2. This new update doesn't include any new features, but it does include support for the new Alexa 35 base, as well as the 1TB express drive if you want to use it when shooting ProRes on the Alexa 35 Premium. It's worth noting that this is the firmer version that all new Alexa 35 cameras will ship with, so if you haven't updated yours already, head over to Adi's support pages linked below to update your camera. And I'm afraid this is all the time I have for this week. I'll be back again next week with more news in 90 seconds.